Hi everyone! In this video, we are going to look at my triple seat calendar and how to utilize its features such as adding events, filtering, creating calendar notes, and exporting it to my personal calendar. I do have a thumbnail version of the calendar located right on my dashboard, but to access the full calendar, I will simply click the tab on the left here. Here is the full version of my triple seat calendar. I have some customizations I can make related to how to view information on my calendar. Keep in mind that when I am changing the view of my calendar, this only affects my calendar. Each user has their own calendar view, so adjusting anything here will not affect other users in my group. First, I can change the time period that I am looking at. From this drop-down on the top left, I have the option to view our events by month, week, day, or a timeline view. I can also customize which events appear on my calendar. By selecting the Filters button on the right-hand side, I will have the option to filter out my events by status, by location and room if I have access to more than one location within my account, or even by owner. Maybe I am only interested in seeing definite events that I am the owner for. If I am in the timeline view, it gives me a quick glance at my day as a whole. I can see this shows what's going on at my venue, at any given hour, and in what room. This is a quick and convenient view to determine which spaces are available at a certain time during the day. If I find a time slot when I want to book an event, I can simply click and drag to initiate the booking process within that specific room. If an event has a setup and teardown time planned and I'm in the timeline, day, or week view of the calendar, I can also choose to display those times as separate or combined with the event. Similar to the calendar view, when I apply a filter to my calendar, this only affects my calendar. No other users in my group will be affected. It is important to note that these filters will not clear automatically if I leave this page, so I do need to make sure that I click Clear All when I want to see all events. Below, I also have the option to color the calendar by room, location, status, or event style. The default is by status. Only the room colors can be changed by a user with the appropriate access. On the top left corner of each day, there is a small blue bubble which is for entering a calendar note. Calendar notes have a few different uses in Triple C. The first is just to add a note that I would like my team to be aware of, such as a nearby parade happening on this date. A second use of the note is to block off space for something that is not a private event. Let's say I can't have any events in this area because the floors are being cleaned. When I am adding the note, I will give the note a title, select the area being affected. I can also select a specific event style if my venue has more than one enabled. For example, I could make sure this only affects on-premise events. I will also select the time frame. The time frame could be all day, just a few hours in one day, or could last for multiple days. Before adding this note, I want to be sure to check off Prevent Bookings for the duration of this note. If the floors being cleaned were a monthly thing, I could also have this note repeat. Now, when anyone is creating an event during this note's time frame, they will not be able to choose the area that is out of commission. To create an event from the calendar, I can click on any day in the future directly from this page and select Create Event to begin the process for a new event. To view an event, I will simply click into it and then I can see a snapshot of information as well as click into any event documents right from the calendar view. I also have the option to include holidays on my calendar, which any settings user would be able to turn on by going to the Preferences settings. Finally, at the bottom, there is a button labeled Export. Triple Seat's calendar integrates with Google, Outlook, and iCal, doing a one-way push of my Triple Seat events to my personal calendar. Meaning, any events I add to Triple Seat 
will show on my personal calendar once linked. This button will generate the links needed for this calendar export. On this page, I can filter this export by event status, location, owner, and event style. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please reach out to the support team, support at triplesseat.com, or by clicking the help question button at the top right corner of any screen in Triple Seat.